Well, for today, we're going to start off with our first alert weather spotters. This is a great photo from April in Jupiter. Nice to see a lot of folks enjoying uh, or at least taking advantage of those stronger winds there with the kite boarding. So hopefully everyone is safe because the waters are going to be quite rough over the next few days. But as of right now, we are looking at breezy conditions with your winds ushering in from the east to southeast anywhere from 15 to even close to 20 miles per hour. As far as temperatures go, we're currently clocking in in the middle and upper 70s as we have 78 in Jupiter, 75 in Stewart, and we also have 77 in Boynton Beach. Now, what you can expect for this evening, the winds continuing to remain strong. Few clouds expected tonight and overnight lows in the upper 60s to the lower 70s. Winds still staying with us, so you know what? Tomorrow is going to be a breezy day. Uh, high temperatures reaching into the middle 80s tomorrow afternoon and dealing with partly sunny skies. Talking about the winds, we do have a small craft advisory in effect as well as a high surf advisory. So the waters are going to be fairly rough for our boaters, so please be cautious. But as we are looking at your rain chances, because we do have a system approaching fairly minimal. The system continues to trend a little bit later near dinner time on Thursday and overnight into early Friday. So we really don't have those elements or the ingredients for that front to really unleash. So breaking it down for you right now, we're talking about high pressure systems staying in control with us for today, but we are watching a lot of this action out towards the west of us because that low pressure system is going to dig in areas north of us. Now, as far as your Thursday severe weather threat, lock towards the north of us. We are not in a severe weather threat. And again, reiterating this system moves in closer towards dinner time. So stopping your Viper cast at five o'clock Thursday evening rain showers starting to approach now at 630 seeing rain showers across the area. As you can see, this pretty much falls apart uh, after dinner time. And as we get into the overnight time frame, this looks to clear out by daybreak on Friday, which means we'll see, start to see some clearing sunshine returns for Friday afternoon. But those temperatures will be cooling down back to those upper 70s and lower 80s. And keep in mind, we'll be washing away the humidity so we have another picture-perfect weekend in store for us.